Uh, my name is Scott Taylor, and I'm the proud parent of Jeffrey Taylor. He's my son. And I've spent almost the past 30 years on active duty in the Army Reserve. Professionally, I am the uh, coordinator for diversity, equity, and inclusion for Davis County Public Schools, Owensboro, Kentucky. And um, we have a district for about 12,000 students. I'm a single parent. I lived in Kentucky at the time. My son lived in Oklahoma with their mom. So he made a 14 on this reading. And uh, we worked extensively on, on reading. So when he took the test recently, which was last April, he felt like he was really, really confident. And when he got a score back on reading, he made a 28. He knocked it out of park, like literally knocked it out of park, made a 28 on it. From a 14 to a 28. From 14 to 28, yes, sir. He doubled it. Yes. I can't say uh, just uh, so many, just so many high compliments for what e-knowledge could do. Very individualized program. It was easy for Jeffrey to work on the program. I could track it. Instead of saying, hey, Jeffrey, are you working on it? I could say, hey, Jeffrey, it looks like you only work 15 minutes. Dad, I've been pretty busy. Hey, listen, I understand that. So we, the culmination was Jeffrey working two hours a weekend on the platform. Uh, currently, he's applying uh, to the School of Music Ball State. He's been admitted to the school, out actually. So he has gotten one of the mid-tier uh, scholarships, the Ball State Scholars Award, and really show him if you trust the process, you go through and understand the process, then it's going to take care of itself. It really is. And as I was communicating and my son was going through this platform, I had the idea, why don't we use it for our district? Primarily for our students that are underrepresented. Now, this isn't saying that this isn't going to be for white kids or people in the dominant population because they can use this. But I do know historically, test scores with African Americans, Latinos, Latinos are, are historically lower than their white counterparts. That's the other thing that I want students to realize, that this is a ticket to call your own shots. Mm -hmm. This isn't just something like, oh, my baby made a 28 or I made a 28. No, this 28 has an effect on how your college is going to be funded. It can be taken care of. This platform just gives the blueprint, it gives a roadmap to getting them ready, not from not only from an affordable standpoint, but also from a standpoint where everyone can see and track what the student's doing. Also, the student can do that as well. So it makes it so easy. And all you have to do is just put in the time. Right. <laughs> just put in the time. It's a great platform that's affordable, yet at the same time, it has the challenge and the rigor to get any kid ready for their ACT, SAT. Can't say enough about what it did for my son and also what it can do for our students when it comes to equity and really closing the gap and giving them an opportunity to be successful. So when you're talking about equity, it's not necessarily equal in the playing field, it's giving people what they need at that, at that given moment. And for our African-American students, uh, for our minority students, this is, I feel, what they need as far as getting them prepared to be successful for the ACT and create an environment that they know they have expectations that they can be successful. They can look at that high school sign wherever they're going to on a Saturday morning and say, hey, I'm about to knock this out the park. I'd like to give a shout out to NFHS, National Federation of High Schools, and just, just thank you so much for allowing me to talk about my son's success for e-knowledge, but also what it can do for our students of color and what it can do to close the gap. I mean, that's the metric that every school district has on their equity dashboards when we're looking at test scores. And uh, I'm glad that you have this platform that we can use and we can leverage and to make students successful. Again, every American kid needs to be 
they need to be prepared for the ACT, SAT. It's just a phenomenal program. And uh, thank you for the opportunity for me to, to share um, about e-knowledge and what it can do for our American students.